My name is Cannabis Rollins. My journey is beginning. A journey that I hope will open the doors of life to me and link my past with my future. A journey that will bring me to a strange and dark place. From Hammerfell to Skyrim to a house called Rollinwood. A world that I have never known with people I have never met. People who tonight are still only shadows in my mind, but who will soon fill the days and nights of my tomorrow. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. All right, Night Mother. I'm back. The vampire that I turned has been destroyed. The child of Lachance is exceeding all of our expectations. She truly will be able to save our family if we continue to allow her potential to grow. Yet another child has prayed to their mother. Go to Solitude, talk with the frightened salesman, take his gold, and so begins another contract. Very well, Mother. Cicero, I hope all is well. All right. So, I've been putting thought into promoting Valor to my silencer. If this mission goes well, I believe I will. For now, Valor and I need to find the salesman. In solitude. All right. Where is Vala? Is she already in solitude? Has anyone seen Vala? Anyone? You reek of death. Thank you. How's our latest recruit? This better be good. <laughs> All right then. Yes, such sharp wit. All right, I'm headed to Solitude. I want you all to hold it down. Oh, there you are, Vala. <laughs> Very sneaky of you. I had no idea. I thought you had already left for solitude. All right, then. Let's pull up our map and get our bearings. And let's go. Here we are in solitude. You know you can afford a septum or two. All right, it looks like our meeting will take place inside. A coin or two for a veteran? It's not much. It's time for a little illusion since it's the middle of the day. Ask. The winking skeever. Take a load off and enjoy the atmosphere. Hmm, he must be downstairs. These people look like they're asking for trouble. Sir. 
Are you the salesman? You have to help me. What do you need, Franz? Someone is trying to kill me. I... I think he's a vampire. <laughs> Why would a vampire try and kill you? Really? I have no idea. He's been following me for the past several months as I've traveled Skyrim. Where is he now? I lost him in Fall Creek. I paid a guard to sneak me out of the city during the day. Okay. Did you happen to notice where he was staying in Fall Creek? There was an enclave almost directly west of the city. Wait, I know you. Time to go. All right, let's go. That guy was really frightened. Who exactly are we up against here? You know what? How well do you know me, sir? How does anyone know that we're down here? You can't win this. Someone do something. Captain, really? Come quietly or taste the yard's death. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Hmm, I'm with the guild. Is this enough to clear my bounty? I can make all your problems with the guards go away, but it'll cost you. What do you say? I'm undecided if I want to kill you all, or pay the bounty. But this time I think I'll pay. Done. Now move along before you get me in trouble. Val, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to strike you. You were standing behind the guard. It shouldn't have happened. But anyhow, it's time for me to feed. Could not let all this blood go to waste. And Captain, Imperial armor. Hmm. All right, sir. I'm sorry you had to see that. Now, let me go take care of the vampire that's after you. And be thankful that it isn't me. Come on, Vala. Just have to fight the urge to go on a killing spree. Hmm. I really like what they've done with Solitude. Beautiful. Alright, I'm really not sure where we're supposed to be going. seem to have an idea, Vala. Maybe I should be following you.
right, well, we finally got out of solitude. Vala, I need to speak with you. Oh, I was just thinking about you. Funny how that works. Put on your hood. <laughs> All right, here's the plan. So, are we heading down to Falkreath and hunting some vampires? No, we are not. What? Why not? Just because we didn't collect his money yet? It's not about the money. Vampires are far more dangerous than you realize. I know that they're dangerous, but I'm ready to learn. How else am I going to grow into the assassin you... The family needs me to be. I can handle a few vampires. Besides, if they're anything like Babette, I can definitely handle a few vampires. <laughs> Babette would snap your neck like a twig, and she is in the body of a child. I want to help you. Your dedication is admirable. That is why I have a more important task for you. What could possibly be more important? Our sanctuaries are empty. I'm tasking you with recruitment. That... that is an important task. It's the most important task. How am I to do this? The way I taught you. I'm promoting you to my silencer. You will answer to me. What's a silencer? Basically, think of it as the sharp point of a dagger. I see. Go with this listener. And you, Silencer. Alright, so I'm headed back to the Falkreath Sanctuary. I'll see you later. Here, I thought I'd never set foot in this place again. So I'm looking for some sort of clue. Astrid's corpse. It's difficult. Wait a minute. This wasn't here before. And I'll take these blood potions. So, vampires have taken over the sanctuary. There's 
there's really no way around in here anymore. So was there some other clue? night was it night time what time is it it's 8 p.m. this is night what else would I be looking for something in the water Nothing. This perhaps? Wolf's journal? Yes. All right. Second of first seed for E18. Corinth. This place will be the home that Chiden Hall can never be again, can never again be. I am looking forward to starting my new life here. I suppose I must count myself fortunate. I still have a life at all, given the difficulties I had in Chiden Hall. Most initiates or even seasoned assassins would be on edge in the sanctuary that the listener calls home. I can only count it as a blessing given it likely saved my life. A simple delay to the damned Red Guard's return from a contract, a simple reassignment of a time-sensitive matter to the next available brother or sister, which happened to be me. A rivalry is born, albeit one-sided. He took such enraged offense to my not only stealing his contract, but earning the bonus on its completion that I honestly thought I was going to gut me with that scimitar of his. As if it were my fault, he had to take the long way home from that bandit contract he was on. The speaker gave the contract to me and performed it well enough to earn a storied, a storied dagger that the listener once owned. Sufferthorn. Not only was my success met with near rage from the Hammerfell quarter of our little sanctuary, but my next two contracts were almost botched due to an extra mercenary protection in one case and near capture by the Imperial Legion in the other. I lost my prize during the escape from the Legion. They had a battle mage, a battle mage of all things, and his spell disarmed me. I expressed my concerns to the speaker, but they were clearly falling on deaf ears. Until the listener stepped in, having overheard the conversation from the hall, both my suspected rival and I were talented assassins. I was told without proof of one interfering with the other's work, there was no sanction the listener was willing to perform. He instead transferred me to elsewhere where my talents, I was assured, would not only be valued but vital in the revitalization of the Dark Brotherhood in the region. So here I am, the newest assassin to join the ranks of the Corinth family, the Khajiit, have been welcoming, to say the least. The others here have been friendly enough in their way, though they clearly don't hold the same enthusiasm for my arrival as the Khajiit. 
Still, at least, there is no animosity amongst the family members here, and there are so very many places to hide here. So much of the landscape is open, but full of hills to hide behind. How long is this? This is incredibly long. Hmm. Too incredibly long. This is unbelievably long. You know, maybe he should have broken this up into smaller journals and hidden them about. All right, finally. Okay, it's time to go back and speak with Nazir now. Nazir? The Dark Brotherhood is on the rise again, listener. I can feel it. Hmm, what can you tell me about yourself? Ah. Well, I'm Redguard, as I'm sure you've noticed. Though not like most of my kind you'll find in Skyrim, that's for damn sure. You've got people to kill, my friend. But yes, listener? Let's talk. Listener, we have a problem. Odd. I was just about to say the same thing. Oh. You first, listener. Have you ever heard of the Crimson Scars? No. They were a splinter group of the Dark Brotherhood made entirely of vampires. We destroyed them, however, they have reformed and are after blood. Our blood. That is indeed troubling news, listener. That makes what I have to say all the more dire. And what is it? We have a visitor. Come with really? me to the torture chamber. Who? A member of the Marad Khan. Well, this just gets more interesting. I suppose I'll leave my... No, actually, I don't want them to know I'm a vampire. What's going on here? Excuse me. Excuse me, are you going to open your eyes? You're with the tong? I had heard you had been disbanded. We had. Ah, here we are. Killed the Emperor. We had been hearing rumors that you were trying to rebuild. We cannot allow that. I assume you have writs of execution on us. That I do. The Great Houses of the Dunmer are nervous about your resurgence. This is the first time they've all had a common goal in a long time. 
The Dark Brotherhood must be destroyed. <laughs> Your life ends here. The Morag Tong will live on forever. The Brotherhood will fall. <laughs> Seriously. Why would he just stand here and let me kill him? Somewhat interesting, Nazir. Things proceeding well, listener? Let me see that writ of execution. We are growing stronger every day, listener, but even we cannot fight a war on two fronts. All right, so he wants to kill us all. No, we can't. I have an idea. Where is Undil? He just got back from a contract. What did the Tong agent say while I was gone? Well, listen, I tortured him for several hours. He started out the day cursing me and my family. However, I eventually broke him. He told me that he and two others were in a cave near Winterhold on a border of Skyrim and Morrowind. I want to study our enemy a bit before sending the scars after them. A smart move indeed. Time to speak to Undil. Yeah! 